Meantime, disturbing story out of Middlesex County mm -hmm. today. A missing girl found dead, and now the child's mother and her boyfriend are facing charges. News 12 New Jersey's Carolyn Blackburn joins us now from the Edison Police Department. And Carolyn, what are the police telling you? Well, police say that they have charged Matthew Childs and Monique Durham in connection with the death of that little girl. Officers say it all started after a call for a welfare check here in Edison. This is the home of Monique Durham in Edison. Officers say they were called here last Tuesday to check on Durham's two five-year-old little girls. That's when police say they found out one twin was missing and no family or friends had seen or heard from the child since 2019. Now, officers say Durham's boyfriend, Matthew Childs, killed the little girl all those years ago. He's now facing a first degree murder charge and Durham has been charged with endangering the welfare of a child. Danny Tromboli lives in the same complex and knew the couple. It's horrifying, awful, it's disgusting. Cops were here for a couple hours, probably about like four or five, I would say. Yeah, and it was just a disaster here. You know, you didn't know what was going on. There was a lot of activity. In Perth Amboy, officers used a search warrant to look around Childs' property. Police say through their investigation, they found out Childs killed the little girl three years ago and disposed of her remains. They were all over. I mean, they were also in other people's yards as well when we were, were looking at them. I mean, they were definitely out here with a motive to try to find something, and they were definitely going all over. Neighbors here were not exactly shocked that Childs was charged. They say he has a short temper. I grew up with him. I mean, everybody grew up in the neighborhood. I mean, always at one point in time, he always had like this anger management problem. Like he would always lose control. You hear him screaming, arguing with his parents, his mother. Um, it's unfortunate. Now, both Childs and Durham are locked up right now at the Middlesex County Adult Correctional Center. In Edison, Carolyn Blackburn, News 12, New Jersey.